As you can see, there are a lot of problems with this heavy picture. Um, the breasts are a bit squared, there is a bad rest or just bad made edge at the dress and we miss a piece of upper arm. Now how are we going to correct this? First of all, we duplicate our layer, calling it torso, torso, liquify. Okay, and then we go into the filter menu to liquify. It takes a while to load, at least if you work with a big file, which I am doing, but that's probably something you're not seeing. We zoom in on the edge of the cloth, uh, make sure it's in the center, and go to our masking brush, put our size correct, and then we mask out the parts of the dress we don't want changed. Um, anything that's colored red, if you start moving and pressing together pieces of picture in a few seconds, the pieces that are red will not be affected by your brush. Very important to us. Okay, we go to our standard liquify brush, we put the size a bit bigger, and we click and drag and thus move the texture together. Voila! Now we go to our mask eraser tool, erase the mask, et voila! A good edge on the dress. Now squared breasts, hmm, not something I like, so we're gonna correct it to the standard liquify tool, brush a bit higher and just drag the black and blue as it get more round. Oh, yet another square part. We finished? Yes, we're finished. Okay, okay this is another fun thing. It's the bloat tool. Bushing, press, press. Oh, oh, there they go. They grow, they grow. I suspect a lot of fashion magazines do use that in first life, but press Ctrl LC to undo that and then we move over to the arm. Again, we mask out the part that should be arm, so we can get rid of that ugly triangle sticking out. And we go to our move tool, while well, size doesn't matter that much, as we're dragging black anyway. Voila! And then we clear our mask again. We add another mask on the parts that should stay black. Yes, a bit bigger makes it easier to color. Gonna fine tune it later anyway. Okay, voila! We click liquify tool, we drag, and we remove our mask. Voila! Hmm. Looks good, nice. A bit of fine tuning with a finer brush. Voila! Oh, that part sticking out should go too! Oh, dress fits perfectly now. Hmm. This looks unnatural too. Inward a bit there. Bigger brush needed. Yes, yes. Inward, inward, inward. Nice way of correcting bone structure. Yes. Voila. Okay, let's look at our results. Well, as soon as they are rendered. Hmm. Later, I'm visible. Ooh. Lot of improvement. Look at that arm. Yes, but the breasts are just a little bit square. No filter. Liquify again. Zoom, 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 zoom. Okay, we move brush size smaller, a bit bigger. Yes, that shall do. And we make it even more round. Voila. Mm. At this point, I've chosen not to really change breasts a bit. I need to change the breast, but I can't change the cloth on the left, so I'll mask it, and then I can go ahead without affecting the pixels under the red masks. Voila, we. Well, 
a bit more on the right breasts. Maybe it's easier if I drag them out of art. Yes, yes, that's better. Okay, fine tuning. Oh, erase, erase the mask. Here we go. Okay. Let's look at our results again. Yes, looking good, looking good. <laughs>